This is Rogers TV, Gray County. Hi, Lois. Hello, Diane. So this is exciting. I know, right? I am so happy. We're, we're actually starting a new show, and it's going to be called You Never Know because we're going to be handing over the baton for It's Happening Here with Lois and Diane. It's actually going to be called It's Happening Here, and the new hosts are Savannah and Tiffany. Hi. Yeah, hi. Hello. And uh, the folks at home will recognize these two. Like you've stepped in on various occasions and yes. um, yeah, did we've... such a great job. You got hired for big bucks to go. <laughs> right? That's right. Yeah. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, they didn't tell you. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> well deserved. <laughs> we're really excited. We have big shoes to fill, but mm -hmm. we are, oh. we're excited to see what spin we can do if it's happening here. Mm -hmm. So do you have any ideas at this point what that new spin will be? Younger. No. <laughs> teasing. <laughs> I hate her already. <laughs> no, I'm teasing. We don't know. We, we, like I said, we have really big shoes to fill. Mm -hmm. we're, we're a little nervous and excited and mm -hmm. um, curious to get out there into the um, businesses in Owen yeah. Sound and surrounding and see what they have to offer and why our community is so great. Yeah, that's I'm, awesome. I'm looking forward personally, like watching you guys going to different businesses. I've lived here my whole life, but watching that show really got to see the behind the scenes. So I'm looking forward to going with you to the businesses yeah. and getting to in person yeah. hear all the when stories. When Lois and I got together and just called each other out of the blue basically and said, we want to do this. It was during COVID. Mm -hmm. So I too, learned a lot mm -hmm. and I found it was so much fun because it was that atmosphere of just going into someone's home and just let's just sit and talk and of course when you're proud of your business you really want to showcase it mm -hmm. so I learned a lot there was businesses downtown that I didn't know I saw them and we went in but just to see it from their passion mm -hmm. and that's what we really focused on wasn't it was their yeah. passion yeah and at that time too I the 10th Street Bridge was out. Yeah. So a lot of our businesses downtown were suffering. And mm -hmm. I, I like to think that we helped out in our in our little way, like yep. that we brought awareness to downtown. And I agree. Um, mm -hmm. You yeah. know, we want businesses to thrive and our local community. It's not all about online shopping. We've no. got terrific businesses here. And yeah, we do. You know, yeah. But, yeah. That's it's, what we're excited about, too, is uh, yeah. showcase um, all the terrific businesses we have and, yeah. you know, shop local. That's a, mm -hmm. that's a big thing. You, mm -hmm. It puts a lot back into the community. So, yeah. mm -hmm. and we did a lot of restaurants too at that time. Cause that was, it like, shows. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm looking forward to that then. <laughs> you know, there was cuisine that I'd never tasted before. Like mm -hmm. curry. You've never no, had curry we went before. To never had curry. Oh. And that was an experience. We went to Sabitri's and... And I'm, they won me over. Mm. It, but they did it very light for me. Yes, they did. Yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. but it's very flavorful. It doesn't need a lot of heat, no. right? No, it doesn't. And mm. what was interesting is Lois loves heat. Mm. So I would sit here. We went to one restaurant, which was hilarious because it was Popeye's. Oh, right. Yeah. And they had this devil pepper or whatever. Oh, the ghost was, pepper. The ghost oh. pepper wings or did you try it i didn't she bought me a box or they she had them bring out a box and yeah. i'm like oh these are yummy and i'm watching <laughs> water her eyes did not water yeah. oh my yeah her eyes did not water it was amazing some of this stuff and yeah. i think we made friends oh definitely and i yes. think that when you guys go out um you'll get recognized you're young mm -hmm. you're both pretty Beautiful. and i think that it's um going to be fun because it's not me well of course Lois was the pretty side of the group oh. but it was um they they just loved having you there and mm -hmm. when you showed their interest and their passion and what they do and and you got involved in their feelings that mm -hmm. to me was a win-win yeah wasn't mm -hmm. it yeah. Oh, yeah I remember when we went to the reach Lois and I it was so exciting to see everything they do from their community shop that they have and mm -hmm. just over the summer here they did pop-up cafes and yeah. just to see everything that you know the local community and businesses have to offer I think that's what I'm excited about yeah, yeah. And yeah. after that, after we went there, she had a race for reach 
So I did a whole fundraiser event for at that race, um, like a a raffle table. And oh yeah! Oh my gosh! Mm. It was. It went well. It, it, just made me feel so good. I know. Nice. I know. Nice. And we did the same thing for Reach after we were there. Um, we went again. And the chamber, actually, what they did is that we had a bench made. Aww. And then we donate during Flowers and Bloom. River mm -hmm. District. Oh, River District oh, and Bloom. Nice. Okay. We had a bench made. It was sitting in front of the city hall. And then they, Reach went, and they watered and took care of the plants because it had to be indicative of our area. Okay. And then once that uh, River District and Blooms was done, we gave it to them. Oh, so they right. could either raffle it off or they could just be part of their horticultural segments, right? Because mm -hmm. they have that whole, that really nice garden just right outside yeah. of yeah. the Reach Center. There, Do you so. remember going to Reach and... Hitting the window. I your... did. <laughs> oh, no. We always like to walk in uh, just to show people where we're going. And mm -hmm. and I, I saw the great big picture window. <laughs> and I'm walking in. I said, watch, Lois. Look, let's look in. And, of course, it was a double pane, and it was quite a distance <laughs> part. And oh. I put my, <laughs> put my head in really quickly and banged my head on the window. <laughs> oh, oh, this one. Oh. oh, my gosh. She was bending over <laughs> laughing. And I'm trying to, you know, think. I think it made the blooper reel, didn't it? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I was going to ask that. I hope there's I'll some have to ask Daryl because I'm not yeah. sure. Uh, there's quite a few bloopers. They keep them, by the way. Yeah. Oh, yes. We should go watch no. them. But what about our bloopers? We'll oh, you won't we'll, have we'll any. We'll delete them. We'll delete them. I don't think <laughs> no, we have no, control no. of that. Daryl is in control. And he now knows. <laughs> Daryl, as people know, is our producer. And he's going to be your producer now. Mm -hmm. And it's just fun because he tells you what to do. But a lot of times we never listened. We just no. did our thing. Yeah. We just did our Do thing. you have any tips or tricks mm. for us? Because mm. this will be our first time. Know your crowd. Know your, your business. So when you go in there, because there's no script, right. you're shooting from the hip. Right. And we got to actually talk to them beforehand and said, tell us what you want. Mm -hmm. What okay. do you want to mention? What do you want to do? Is there anything special happening? Yeah, that right? was the main thing. We, you know, they might have specials or... Um, just whatever promotions yeah. coming up that mm -hmm. they want to feature. So yeah. just uh, the less talking, more questions for them. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 So. It's it's really it's fun because sometimes mm -hmm. it'll just change. Oh yeah. And just be yourself. Be yourself and have fun. Mm -hmm. They want the fun part of it. Mm -hmm. And I think that's why we did well is because we just went in, and we were ourselves. And you'll be a good mix because. You know, you two work together. Yes, mm -hmm. we do. Yeah. So Savannah Sadly. and I. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep in mind that <laughs> uh, Savannah and I work with the, at the chamber. So mm -hmm. we're really excited because we are passionate about local business Businesses. because mm -hmm. we work with the chamber. So yeah, that's what we're excited about. Yeah. Well, I'm yeah. sorry, I'm speaking for you. No. Yeah, yeah. I'm excited too. Yeah, and great. you're doing reels already, so yeah. you're out there and you see the businesses, so they'll be familiar with what you can do. Yeah, but and that's actually a good idea. While we go to the businesses, you can also shoot a reel for oh. Instagram. Yeah. Be yeah. like a two-in-one yeah. kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it's amazing how um, they just they they just welcome you in. Yeah. Because yeah. they know that we're there for them. Mm -hmm. I don't think we've met anyone that's like, oh, my gosh, what are you doing here? No, if we've had some, that, and they're very nervous when you go yes. in, so you just yeah. kind of like, and usually by the time we leave, they're like, oh, you guys just made this so much fun. Yes. And they, so, you know, you yeah. wanna... We have big shoes to fill. Yes, we do. No, no. you don't. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, be, you'll be awesome. We wouldn't have suggested you if um, mm -hmm. we didn't know that you could do it and, and do it your way. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Yeah, we're yeah. excited. And you're actually changing your for, your um, format, and you're doing it to one location at a time. Yeah, I think yeah, so. Hopefully, we're gonna, hopefully, we want to try to give as much uh, to the feature to the business as possible when we go in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And on that note, we are still we're looking for businesses that are interested. If they yeah. want to be featured on it's happening yeah. here, they can contact myself or Savannah mm -hmm. and. Mm -hmm. We start filming well, I've given shortly. You quite a few names. Yeah, yeah, I've been out and about a little bit, Lois. And uh, when I'm talking to certain businesses, I'll mention it's happening here, and I'm also sort of recruiting people to come here as a sit down, oh, okay. which is good. But th it's happening here, so with us, it's like a double whammy. Right. You yeah. know, with them, they're showcasing the business. With us, we're showcasing the person. Yes. And what they can do. Yes. So still making it fun from both um, 
both sides of it. Mm -hmm. But is there something you're gonna miss? Because you it was three years that you did it's happening here. Three years. I'll miss going into the businesses that I would not have normally Me too. you know, gone into. But I'll I'm, miss I'm the really people. excited about this new format I am that too. we're doing. I am too. Um, I like how your husband named the show. Yes. Yeah. Did you oh, not know that? No. My husband, when Lois and I were trying to figure out what to call it, and we went through a, oh, a whole ton of, bunch mm -hmm. of names. Yeah. And uh, we kept going back and forth and back and forth. No, no, no. I kept wrinkling our nose. And I was sitting with my husband at home, and he said, well, the two of you, you never know what's going to happen. <laughs> or what's going to be said. <laughs> or what's going to be said, or what you're going to do. And he said, I think you should call it You Never Know. So is that well? Lois weird? said at first, well, I don't know, but then she went away and thought about it, and then she texted me while you were away, and she said, you know what? I think that'll do. I think it'll so that'll work for us, and it's so true when we think about it. Yeah, because you never know. Well, at least you happen. don't have to worry about walking into a double pane window. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sure yeah. there'll be something else. Oh, <laughs> it caught me in some very uncompromising positions <laughs> as well. And at that point in time, he never saved the bloopers, and it was like, <laughs> 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 yeah. uh, We also snorted a lot. We snorted um, a lot as well, um, laughing, just the two of us, because we would find something that the other one said, and he kept it in. He just kept it in. So don't be embarrassed. Just mm -hmm. like I said. Yeah. Be yourself. Yeah. I am going to miss it. Don't get me wrong, because I'm going to miss the people. Mm -hmm. So if ever you can't make an episode or whatever, maybe Diane or I will fill in. Yes, yeah. of oh, course. Yes, absolutely. Oh, that'll yeah, be terrible. I'm sure you're going to be missed, but it's nice to know that you'll still they'll still be able to see you and mm -hmm. yes, have yes. you in the community still, mm -hmm. which is nice. I feel we'll positive. I feel positive that we're handing the baton over. Yeah. Oh, to yeah. You for, too. Sure. Mm -hmm. I, for sure. I'm. I'm. I'm excited. So we've only got a minute left. So I'm just basically saying, is there any special things that you want to bring into the show or where the different venues or genres you're going to do? We're going to do a dance routine at the start of every show. Awesome. <laughs> I'm kidding. I can't Get dance. a little TikTok on. Get a little TikTok on. Um, Make it more real, you know? Yeah. 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 Well, just, just do that. You know. Yeah. Do that. You know, there's just so many things you could do, even the opening. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, like us, I was going into his, uh, the building and hitting my head on the window. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I might be the comic be. relief in <laughs> so okay, we'll see we'll see this afternoon. We have, um, we're going to be talking about our new show. Yes. Yes, we are after break. So what's coming up is, um, we had a really good summer and we were really honored and blessed when Alex Ruff. Yes. So we're going to talk about that and the special um, award he gave us. And it's funny because it wasn't nominations from, wasn't from, you know, it was pe people out there and because he sent out an e-blast basically saying we're looking for nominations for people in the community that have done something in the community. And you and I were recipients of yes. that. So we're going to talk about that. Yes. And we really want to thank you. No, thank I you. wish thank you, you the best of luck. You won't need it, but I wish you well. And by all means, we're here if you need us. Mm -hmm. um, we'll, be, we'll be asking yeah. you for help, I'm sure. Yeah. We're yes. really excited and nervous, but it's good nerves. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Everyone well, will love you. Yeah. We're passing thank the baton you. to the, now, the new what? It's Happening Here. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank ladies. You. And we'll be right back. Thank you so much for inviting us to your office, Alex. Well, we, we're, we're it's happening. Yes. This is amazing. Yes. I'm so honored to be here. Thank you so much. Well, look, Diane and Lois, it's great to have both of you here. As the community knows, I called for nominations for King Coronation's pins. I, each member of parliament across the country were given a number of pins, so I chose to award 20 of them to constituents right across the riding based on nominations that we received from the community. And fortunately, both of you beautiful ladies have were, were nominated and are receiving it. So Diane, uh, I'll just read this real quick. Uh, 
As a member of Parliament for Bruce Gray on, uh, Owen Sound, I'm honored to present Diane Austin with a King Coronation pin to recognize your service to, the, to our community for your impact, incredible impact in the community of Owen Sound and beyond, including your volunteerism, providing time and effort to numerous, numerous committees and fundraising initiatives, along with your support to small businesses through promotion and a passion to assist. And then it talks a little bit about the, the, the additional stuff. So that, that's the certificate. If I can get you to hang on to that. That is well I deserving, have, Diane. Oh, Lois, thank you. And I have this the pin exciting. here, and I'm going to touch and try not to poke you here too too bad. I'm going to put this pin. This might deflate. <laughs> no. <laughs> thank you. There you go. Thank you so much. And if I could have what the an other honor. One. <laughs> and similarly for you, Lois. I won't read the whole front part, but for your incredible impact in the community, Owen Sound and Beyond, especially for using your expertise in marketing to support small business and your commendable fundraising efforts for numerous initiatives. So again, with the King's Coronations pin, I, I asked everybody to nominate people based on three of the King Charles III's sort of key community uh, service aspects of conservation, collaboration, and compassion. And I believe, and I know all through both of you ladies, fully represent uh, those three key elements. So here's your certificate. You so and at the much. same time, I'm going well to pin deserved. this on. Well deserved. Oh, I'm so proud of you. I'm so <laughs> proud of you. It's solid gold, right? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what the current government likes yeah. to give out. So we'll, we'll see how well, that Well, it's helps. heavy. Yes. Yeah. So again, congratulations. Thank Very you. well deserving uh, of this recognition. and. Uh, just want to say thank you for everything that you do for our greater community. Keep up the great work. Thank you so much. Thank you. No problem. Oh, yeah. The heck with that. We're getting a hug, right? Yeah. Thank you. Take this care. is a great honor. No problem. And we really do. It's nice to be recognized. Oh, I have, I'm turning yes, it around. Yes, we should do that real quick. Yes. Thank so you. Again. And thank you for what you do. Yes. No, thank I'm just you. doing my job. Yeah. What an honor this was. That was such an honor. I was so proud of you and so proud of us that we we actually were nominated for this. I know, but he only, um, there was 20 people in his whole riding. I thought there was 100. Oh, but it was 20. I think last year it was, but to me, this is more important mm. because there was only 20. Right. That must have been awfully hard for him to pick and to think that we were two oh, no, of the 20. No, <laughs> 18 others. <laughs> right, <yeah. laughs> 18 others, but hey, but I just love it. And I love that we have this forever. You yes, know. and this pin. Yeah. Oh, that we, pin. I, you were hilarious okay. when you actually said, does it have big Well, I haven't ears? tested it yet, so oh. take it to the gold tester. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you would know yeah, yes. if it was really gold. No. But it was it was an honor But that wasn't privilege. the only thing he gave us that day. Wasn't that something? Right. I think what was really interesting about that is that he doesn't hand these out lightly. And for him to come out of his office and actually present these beautiful silver medallions, and they are heavy. Yes. No, yeah. I and I was. Um, I guess I knew that? I was getting the pin, but so this kind of um, came shocked out of the blue. Will yeah. you say like so? I didn't. I wasn't really retaining much. Yes. So what was this for? Yes. This one is for leadership. This is leadership and um, service, making a difference in the community. So what he said was outstanding leadership and service. Oh. And he actually designed these. He actually did the, designed them himself and he does not hand them out lightly. He just hands out a very, so far very few. And they're numbered. Yeah, they're numbered. Mine is 160. What is yours, <laughs> Lois? What's your number? Number one. So I'm gonna scratch <laughs> off six zero. <laughs> So we'll be one A and one B. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, that was very, very, very nice. nice. That was yes. a, a real honor for a sure. A real honor. And I love that they have the coat of arms for the, you know, federal government, yep. Canada. And then he's actually got a picture on the back of his riding, which is really, see here, Gray Bruce. Yes. Yes. Right? So. What do they say? The elephant's. Well, so we're, they, we're apparently the elephant's butt, but they don't have the whole thing <laughs> oh. there. But that's, we're right there. Right. Right? Here's the tail. Oh, See the yeah. tail? Yeah. 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 Anyway, but we're not allowed to say that. No, I'm yeah. thinking I want to get mine framed and somehow... You can actually get it where they could have on the side like this. Yeah, and like then on the shadow the box or something, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. We should do that. Which would be good, but what I an bet honor. you um, Carol downtown does that beside um, Dairy Queen there. 
Oh, um, yeah, the framing place. Yes, I bet framing you could Framing experience do that for or something it's yeah. called, isn't it? I'm yeah, not sure. let's get it done and then we'll show the viewers after. I think that's a great right? idea. Yeah. yeah. Because it's proud. I'm proud. I'm so proud. Mm -hmm. And we didn't do this for the accolades. No, I didn't even know anything about and, it. No. So, so yeah. and, and that's really nice. We did it because this is what we want to do. Yes. And I yes. like that. And this is what we're going to do for our new show that we'll be talking about. Yes, you know, after break. We'll after be, break. Um, yeah. But yeah. right now, I am just so proud to looking at it. And our names were spelled right. I was somewhere where they actually spelled. Right. I, yeah. well, and it's, it doesn't say Lois Lane. It says Lois Taylor, <laughs> which is great. <laughs> So, so um, we are, we're going to go to break. Yep. So thank you, Alex. Her, yes. And we're going to talk about our new show when we come back. Yes, we are. This program is brought to you by Ignite TV. Now you're in command. Visit Rogers.com for more details. Long way from Nashville to Mama, I'll tell you that. Perform from Montreal to Boston to Los Angeles. But Toronto, that's my chosen home. Sure, when I'm walking down Young Street, I see some funny people who have the nerve to point the finger at me. And grin and smile and whisper. My song was number two on local radio. I sold 10,000 in Toronto alone. Turned down Ed Sullivan because they asked me to remove my makeup. Wouldn't do American Bandstand because of their segregation policies. I was just being me. Never tried to explain myself to anyone. And besides, none of that to worry, Jack, because I know I look good. Got a new way of loving, baby. Thought I want to teach it to you. Jackie Shane was a pioneer transgender soul singer, a central figure in the Toronto R&B scene. She helped shape what we know as the Toronto Sound. So welcome back. Uh, now we're actually going to talk about what we're going to do with our new show, You Never Know with Lois and Diane. But we should talk about our sponsor and what we're wearing, first of all. Oh, and, yes. I'm and, very excited. Oh. We got to go to Campbell's Clothier the other day and pick out whatever we wanted to wear. They were so great, too, right? They like, were. We were yeah. there for a couple of hours just trying on different things and saying yes I or no. I want to wear that. No. You, yeah. <laughs> you can't wear that. I'm wearing that. <laughs> No, yeah. they were awesome. They were awesome, and they put things aside for us, and they're going to be doing it for our, every show. Yes. That we're going to be wearing something from Campbell's Clothier and at this, this point. And this is so cool, right? I love the bling on that. Yes. Love it. Just love it. And I love what Lois is wearing. She's being very sexy today. She's wearing leather pants and a black cami, and, of course, she's got that beautiful blingy velvet. It's a velvet top jacket. Yes. And I love it. And I actually, I love print. Um, I'm a little bolder sometimes in my cl the clothes I wear, but I love this one. It's so comfortable and, and so And soft. your pants are amazing. My pants, you can't stand up because... I can't stand up, but they're like MC Hammer pants. Yes. They're, they're right? pleated. You're going to break out and look. Break up and do that. <laughs> you can't touch this. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. But I really, I love their clothes yes. and can't thank them enough for doing that. I know. It's amazing. Great. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But other things we're going to do is, you tell them. Um, oh, so uh, anyone that knows me knows how much I love animals. And yes. um, I've got a real soft spot. So we're going to feature animal shelters. Like there's lots of different, um, there's the Chihuahua Rescue, there's Triton's Rescue, there's Grey Bruce Animal Shelter. There's yes. all sorts of different organizations that really are just amazing. And I want I to help these animals because they can't fight for themselves. So. We are gonna, we're get, gonna showcase that, yeah, and maybe get them special homes. Yeah. One of the things that I'm bringing in that I've talked to Lois is Dr. Maida. Dr. Maida has a rescue farm, and it's not just dogs and cats, but he's got goats and he's got a whole yeah, bunch let's of bring different a goat things. In. We're gonna bring him in and let him talk about his rescue. He's a local doctor in town, and he lives out in the country. And I've talked to his assistant, um, who is a very dear friend of mine. 
Your name is Joanne. And what we're going to do is bring them in. And she said she could bring all sorts of specific Indians. I, I would love to see a pot belly so pig. So do they, um, with, like, can people adopt those? Or it's just a rescue place that, that go? That I you... think so. I think that we'll if find it's... find out more when I will, come. when she comes in, we'll ask. Yeah. yeah. We're also going to be having not only the clothes from Campbell's, but different organizations or retail yeah. in the area to do fashion shows. One of the things that we're going to do is ladies, and we're going to do children. Are we? Yes. I've already hooked it up with um, Urban Planet. Oh. So that we can do little kids one day, and maybe that's around Christmas oh. time. But another thing we're going to be doing is um, cooking. Oh, yes. Yes, cooking. We're we going to bring in a gemologist, hopefully. I don't know any. I know. <laughs> you, no, you do, but you know anyone good. <laughs> I'll pass that on. Pass so. that on, yeah. <laughs> and then we're also going to be doing, um, we're going to have sommeliers in that's going to talk about wine. And, um, well, that's a good one. I know. I won't call in sick that day. No, I know. No, no, <laughs> no. Me neither. <laughs> um, but there's so many. And music at the end. We're going to be oh, showcasing right. yes. a lot of local talent. You've been busy on that. Yes, I have. I've actually got them booked right till next June. I feel bad I haven't done anything. You just wait. Yeah. I got yeah. stuff I'm that sorry. I'm going to get My you kitchen to do. is getting torn apart I as we know. speak. I know. I heard that. I'm going to Texas to babysit my grandkids. I'm yep. just like all over the map right now. So yeah. thank you for oh, doing my everything friend. you're doing to, for me. Yeah, I've, I've started it. You're ending it. Oh, yeah. am I? <laughs> No, it's fun to organize it, but it's just, uh, and no one is saying no. We actually even have uh, legal coming in to basically talk about wills. Oh, great. But, you know, because I haven't got one for my husband yet, so we'll just see. Oh, uh, don't make him the mushroom soup yet. Then. No, I won't. <laughs> Um, I'm going to, we're going to, we have only a minute left or less than oh, a minute. Okay. So I basically want to talk about our entertainment. The, yes, absolutely. The person that's singing at the end of our show. It's not me. It's no, no, I tried. <laughs> Thankfully. My, but what's going to, I wanted to talk about who's, who our guests are for our next segment, our next show. And we're going oh, to yes. have a cooking show with Sophie Douglas. Yes. From your, your um, European, European bakery. bakery. And our good, good friend, Nancy. Yes, Nancy Lloyd. She's, Nancy um, Lloyd. And she had a flower shop for years, and she's going to be doing a, um, an arrangement for Thanksgiving because that's yes. going to be here before you know it. That's our next segment is actually basically a week before Thanksgiving or our next show, I should say. Segments are totally, I'm getting new to this jargon. Yes. So, but so, so I'm going, so anyway, it's going to be interesting. So what we're going to be doing, but our entertainment for the end of the show is Paige Warner. And Paige Warner has an evocative voice. She's excellent. I've listened to her. And she captivates her audience. And what's interesting about Paige is she's a singer-songwriter. And she's blues and rhythms. And uh, well, Let's wonder listen to her. Let's listen to her. Right? She's amazing. Thank you for joining Thank you for in. Joining and stay us. tuned. See you soon. the Rogers TV viewer response line. Email us or connect with us on social media. Summer days, summer nights, lots of things to do, places to go and people to see. If you're having a few drinks, be sure to plan ahead and get home safely. We don't want to pick you up. 